and what up welcome back to my channel welcome back to my garden welcome back to the apple fritter grow so guys day 21 <laughs> yep that's right day 21 it is day 21 and not day 14 because uh, the program that it's, that I was using this usually down here decided to do an update and it erased my week two video so uh, and it no longer allowed me to export my video in 1080p only allowing 720 well I could get like a subscription I could pay for the subscription and still use it at 1080 but that would but using 720 is gonna absolutely kill the quality my low quality that I'm already at so moving forward guys I got a new program figuring things out playing with it it is what it is um, but here we are day 21 as you can see they're filling in nice there's a tent you're looking pretty good you know what I mean here's the uh, next round back here and packing well yeah we're gonna get right into it guys oh and uh it is day 21 the stretch is over so I set the light at 100% the grower's choice ROI E680 is setting out at 100% and we're at 24 inches to the top of the canopy so and this one is just you know it is what it is those are just uh, there's no dimmer or anything on those but yeah let's get let's get right into it
All right, guys. So we gave it some Bloom Booster. I just want to show you guys what it is. This is the Roots Organics Bloom Booster. It's a pink bag. I don't know why the lighting's like this, but we're gonna have to make do. But uh, yeah, we just gave it to him. Here, but here's what it is. Let me get there. All right. So basically, this is everything you need for like late flower support, ultimate support for later stage of natural blossom enhancement okay uh, basically what it is is like a, some uh, a bunch of uh, potassium basically with some you know calcium sulfate of potash phosphate rock crab meal fishbowl meal alfalfa kelp langnabite Slow, slow release, a little bit of slow release from the crab meal, fish bone, and alfalfa. But as you can see, it's got 18% potassium, 6% phosphorus, 8% calcium. Okay, and then of course, you know, we got the coconut pot, the coconut stuff, humic acids, the yucca, and the beneficial bacteria. As you see, it's a little bit less. So, this is what you need to add uh, with, with this uh, from week three and week five with some worm castings. Nope. And you can see a little bit of some calcium spots there. So, I'm going to start whipping up the teas soon, probably this weekend. And uh, yeah, get rid of that because I know that this right here has 8% calcium and this right here has 8% calcium. So when you put those together, that's 16% calcium. I just top dressed 16% calcium into all of these. So it's probably going to be okay, but we'll see. All right. I'm gonna show you guys like how I do like my under lollipopping, I guess you could say. But like if you can look down here, right, there's a thing, there's the base of the plant. And I kinda did most a lot of it already. But I wanted to show you like these little guys, gotta get rid of them. Like this little guy, gotta get rid of that. These ones right here, we gotta get rid of them. Basically, we're gonna go from like this line here and anything right here right there you know these all get to stay right anything else underneath it gotta go so basically like like i said this one gotta go you see right there okay you see this right here this is like a nice little branch but you see that it's underneath it's just below it it's just below it so it's gotta go just like that. And I'm just gonna tell you to put it right, right here in my little pile. But yeah, I'm gonna do this to all of these, all the way through. And yeah. All right guys, as you can tell, not a lot done up there, but down here, we're pre-shaving good. As you can see, I mean the back two, way back in there, couldn't really get to them. So, I mean, there's a few little straggler leaves here and there. What we do? As you can see, though, I did leave, like, this guy there and that little one there. Over here, I got a couple. You know, I got, like, that one there. I got them two there, you know. Not a big deal. Those aren't getting a lot of light. But it's cool. This is how they looking, though. Just basking in the sun. dudes we gotta do a little maintenance here it's time to like top dress they're, they're starting to look a little hungry um these are the these 
were the mother plants for the next round but um i'm just gonna run these they're just uh yeah i think uh we're gonna go with nine ten gallons for these it's gonna be eight rumps and then one apples and bananas but i mean you can see that it's just like thick right so we need to do some lower can canopy maintenance see some of these leaves down there already dying off so we're gonna do some lower canopy maintenance so we're also gonna top them we got some shooters you see this little one right here see this one right here shooting up this one right here shooting up we got some shooters so these over here these right here shooting up so we're gonna even out the canopy do some topping let these uh continue to catch up to the tops as you see they're like right here you know but yeah and then we're gonna top dress i got my worm castings turpsy grow turpsy bloom standard i got the little first one right here as you can see we're definitely topping this thing off right here let it all catch up but when i go down here see all this in here we need to get rid of all that because we can't really do a proper top dress if all that stuff's in the way so I'm gonna show you guys what I do real quick all right first thing I do is I'm gonna take up all this all these little things down in here we're just gonna clean these off, right? Because there's no point in having all that there. Find my scissor. All right, see, about good there. Anything else, you know, I'm not too worried about. I mean, I know that these are really small, but it's still veg, you know what I mean? All right, so the mix is super simple. We're gonna use this turp tea grow, and we're only gonna do one teaspoon. All right, so we're gonna go one teaspoon of the turp tea grow and the turp tea bloom and then like a, a quarter cup I don't think you read it let me see can we read it quarter cup <laughs> of worm castings alright so it's, it's basically just like Doing the other ones. Mix it with that. I'm gonna hit them with the balloon. Okay. And then we're gonna do some long cast. And you know, depending on how uh, how much room you got up here, is how much you're gonna put in. Like this, 
it's such a small little area. Not a whole lot we can do, you know? So what I'm gonna do is try to And then we're going to water it. I better get the tray. I better get the tray. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I better get the tray. It might just be through there. <coughs> All right, so once you're done mix, uh, mixing it up, it's time to water it. Just like that, we're pretty much all cleaned up. So I'm gonna get the rest of these done. If I run into something, oh, we're gonna do the topping next, all right? Oh yeah, I forgot. We'll do the topping next. I got it super zoomed in to show you guys. This is that tall, tall ass one, tall ass branch. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna take this whole top off and let that little guy right there grow. See what I'm saying? So I'm just gonna pop it right there. Now that looks crazy, right? Like I just cut the whole thing off. But in the grand scheme of things, I am letting everything else grow. Because you see that this these are shorter. And I basically just cut it so like these can grow. That, that, and that. Right? And then while that's growing, this is going to grow, this is going to grow, these are going to grow. These will all catch up. Even the ones down here. Even all these ones down here. You, know, you can see they're already starting to catch up. Alright? So it's not like an aggressive top. I could probably even just top it right here. I could probably top it right there. Uh, but we want to let this one grow out here. You know, we want to let it we want to encourage that. So we'll leave it as this and we'll put it back. All right, I'll top dressed, topped, tried to get even, tried to get even. See, so I still got some towels there. I still got that one right there. I'm thinking about really cutting that down. Yeah. And then you can see it's just a shooter. And if I was to pop it right here, right, hard chop it right there. I might just do that. What do I do with my scissor? That's like damn near a clone, but I topped it already. See? So but it's really that's really a fucking shooter right there, you know what I mean? Just like that, topped it off. Big old piece. That was damn near a clone. Think about doing to these apples and bananas right here, but I think it's all right. All right. Enough of that. But you can oh, you can still see that I cleaned up the bottoms here. Uh, better under here. A lot more airflow. <laughs> if you can see, it's still thick.
purchase your tracks today. 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 Your tracks today, 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 today. All right, guys, we're all out of time, so we're going to wrap it up here. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.